I won't kill Blunt. Just for context, my parrot is called Blunt Trauma, and we've nicknamed him Blunt, which isn't a great nickname, to be honest. There's Endermen around there again. Cows, do something. Cows, please. <laughs> this is an interesting start to a, a peaceful little Minecraft. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die, aren't I? I'm gonna feckin' die. Why did I do this? Why did I do this? Go away. I don't want to fight you anymore. I should just stock the farming, honestly. Does he just constantly teleport in the day? Is he looking for shelter? Well, in the end, it turns out he was more afraid of me than I was of him. And really, I should have been scared of him because he killed me fast. Oh, well. <laughs> Please don't blow up. I, d I can't take two defeats in one day, honestly. <laughs> What the hell was that noise? I have to see what's underneath my house. The foundations must be feckin' horrible. There's radon for sure. 100% <laughs> radon down here. Look, oh god, this is just a breeding gra ground for radon. For those of you that don't know, I recently found out like two months ago that my house had like 10 times the like limit of radon that you're supposed to have. Mostly fixed now, so don't worry. <laughs> but yeah, check your home for radon, everyone. Because I legit would have had no idea, but I decided to buy a radon detector and yep. Loads of the stuff. God. Oh no, oh no, you cheeky feckin' skeleton. Feckin' hell, feckin' hell. Oh, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Oh no, oh no, I have nothing. Oh Jesus, it's one of you. No wonder he hurt me so much. The bastard. I didn't die once, didn't I say at the start of the stream that, like, surprisingly, not a lot of death? We- we didn't do any dying, surprisingly. <laughs> and I'm just dying left, right, and center now. Get out of my way, I don't- Give a damn, get out of my way. Feckin' Radon. Radon. He just- He just killed Blunt. He just feckin' killed Blunt. I hate Radon. <laughs> I'm just gonna sit here for a moment and just process all of that. Yeah, Blunt just died. He did. At least I don't have to bury him since we're already underground, you know, always look on the bright side and all that, but, but seriously. I know, we we all had an emotional connection to Blunt. I, I'm devastated too, trust me. It's it's a tough time for me right now. I know that. It's it's shocking, honestly. I can't believe you did it. We can just build a little bit of dirt in here. And then put a little flower. There we go. I'm sorry, I'm just not as in touch with my emotions as I'd like to be. I'd like to just be honest with you and tell you how devastated I am that Radon killed the Blunt, but I'm just not at that stage yet. That's between me and my therapist. I could drive a therapist into retirement. And then my Minecraft parrot died. <laughs> I just started bursting into tears. I think I might explore the ocean. I feel more like exploring the ocean than I do mining right now after that traumatic experience. Get another blunt <laughs> out of context that doesn't sound good i don't know i i don't think i'm ready for another blunt yet in time in time you gotta pick what wilco is gonna eat he wants advice for what he wants to eat in the chat you can help him out i would suggest parrot <laughs> i saw chat kevin dot 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 like this is not a joking manner it is too soon <laughs> village i see some wooden houses that was like the one thing I was like, oh, we're missing this from our house. That is a village. I want, I want to kidnap some. How can we steal them? So I have... Are you okay? <laughs> I was just like, let's relax for a second. Then he just walked by and fell in the hole. Look at all these farmers. They're having a little farmer's market. How many villagers are there? There's loads. One of them's meowing at me. <laughs> oh, bread. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Well, I just gave you a potato famine. A book, I'll take that too. You're not gonna learn anything. I don't want you having an uprising. It's best for me if you stay stupid. All right, how do we get the villager in the boat? It sounds like a joke. <laughs> you can put them on land, can't you, the boats? Okay, yes, yeah, you're right. I should know this, I've kidnapped people before. This is the first time I've seen you so calm and not murderous, you say, as I am kidnapping someone's parent from a village and shipping them off back to my house. Um, I'm lost. <laughs> uh, like, I have, have the coordinates if I really need them, but my pride would take a hit. Okay, there's a lot of sheep. That's a good sign. Ah, oh, yeah, there's my house. I knew it was there all the time. A little joke I do. We're gonna have a little inlet, and it's gonna go right into a, a little cave here. That'll go into the basement of my house, and we'll have the villagers locked away inside. So we'll have a basement <laughs> full of villagers. It's gonna be lovely, trust me. Jim Pickens, is that you? <laughs> 
Yeah. <laughs> I actually don't need it that high because I'm going to be going one more down because of the water, right? Yeah, should be fine. Someone's going to die <laughs> from that. <laughs> Someone is going to die. Tunnel snakes rule. <laughs> yeah, I'll pretend they're joining the tunnel snakes. We'll do the cells to the left. And this will just be like the processing area. Like we'll, we'll have to build the stream all the way in which is going to be annoying but we'll build the stream in as far as here i'm sorry cells <laughs> oh yeah sorry i i hadn't said that part out loud yet i forgot <laughs> i like how this went from let's explore the ocean to let's trap villagers in my basement <laughs> How does it always end up like this? That even looks like an evil entrance. I was going to make it one higher, but I think I'll keep it with the little uh, kind of devil horn sticking up on either side of the tunnel. I think he's getting the picture now, but he's probably like, what a glorious man. He is literally digging through a cave just for me. He's digging through the mountain to get me to the other side, to whisk me to safety from those horrible children back in the village. And then I was just in my head like, mm, he's gonna make so many arrows for me. <laughs> Some plants would really liven up the area. Yeah, but that would just give him hope, which I think would be cruel because he's never coming out of here once he goes in. <laughs> Surely he must get what's coming at this point. <laughs> <laughs> Surely he must have some idea. Look at that. It'll leave in a bit of light here. You could have like a sundial. <laughs> we could make a sundial, but somehow rig it with artificial light so that it, it, it time is moving three times as slow as it should. That would be great. So it feels like he's in here for an eternity. A day is actually three days. <laughs> It would be perfect. I didn't even intend to do this. I had no intention of doing this on this on this episode. I was like, eventually we'll probably like make some sort of a prison. You know, it's bound to happen. But I had no intention of doing it today. But then I ran into the village and well, I couldn't say no. This poor villager. Don't look at me. <laughs> He's like looking around like, are you serious, bro? Put down a bed, he'll go straight to it. Good tip. Oh, but I don't have one. <laughs> All right, you know what? I will give you my bed. How about that for hospitality? Oh, no, dude, don't, don't, dude, what are you doing? It was too perfect, wasn't it? No, dude, oh, come on. <laughs> are you serious? <laughs> really? <laughs> Don't try and run now. What is the point? <laughs> he's just feckin' trouble, this guy. I'm glad he's becoming a prisoner. Now, you are allowed into your new home. Go on. It's like the uh, home makeover. Uh, extreme edition. All right, bus driver. Move that dirt block. Take a look. Go on. Yeah, thank you for the nod of respect. Go on. Go. Dirt. There you go. He's overwhelmed, the poor fella, for all the wrong reasons. <laughs> have little wooden stairs that go up to a platform in the middle. So I can barter with them from up here. Because we're going to close off the cell entirely. <laughs> that way we don't really even need to use the door. The door is more for show. <laughs> so that it's not too depressing, you know? So they think there's a chance of freedom. Because then they'll continue to, to make me goods. That's our first cell done. And we'll build a double cell here. So it'll be this, but mimicked on the other side. And then when I want them to mate... I can connect them this through here. Is this good idea or bad? It feel bad, but it feel right. <laughs> Wait, why do you imprison them? For friend? Oh, no, no, no. This is not about having friends. Trust me, this is about having goods and services. <laughs> what is the villager's name? I don't know. What What do you guys want the villager's name to be? Blunt. <laughs> that's, how, that's how he got reincarnated. He was such a good parrot, he came back as a human. <laughs> and then he gets unlucky enough to be this human. Hen? Yeah, let's call him Hen. Perfect. Yes. Perfect. So if I ever want them separated, I can lock them up like that. <laughs> this is way darker than it needs to be. Like, there is no downside to them mingling when I get a second prisoner. Absolutely none. But yet, here we are. Now, we need more beds because this villager stole mine. In fact... Move over. You don't get a bed tonight. <laughs> Just when he thinks things can't get worse. Oh, the poor bastard. Right, you're staying in there without the bed for tonight. Uh-oh. 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 Come into the water. Stay away from my villager, you monster. What? <laughs> For feck's sake, what am I supposed to do now? He's just sitting there. Such a troll. Yes. Oh, I didn't like that at all. <laughs> 
He waited so patiently for his boat ride. <laughs> Maybe he just wanted to be a prisoner too. Gotcha, a bed hen. Psh, 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 psh. Look. Yeah, happy, huh? Happy. Oh, he was eager for a job. He's just like, thank you, something to do. I just ran to it. <laughs> he wants a bit more than normal. He's ripping me off because I hit him earlier. What a scammer. I know, right? It's like, people thought I was the bad guy, but now you're seeing the kind of person I was dealing with. We're off to see the wizard. We're the wonderful wizard of Oz. I mean, no, we are going to kidnap someone. Never mind. Kidnap the wizard. <laughs> yeah, we're going to kill. The <laughs> kill? Kidnap the wizard of Oz. God damn it, I think I let my grand plan slip there would you like to come with me <laughs> no i'd rather have one that isn't uh working a job that's just a farmer or something what can this guy's name be C can we have this guy's named re so then we have hen and re henry when they're shipped when i force them together to make children we can ship them as henry re hen oh that's a better that's a better ship name <laughs> we'll ship them re hen <laughs> look at that the house is so small it's all up on the top stick and stone may break my bones but they'll also lock the prisoners away i need two of them just so i can let them in I was going to say in and out, but no, just in. Oh, would you look at that? Aren't you a good prisoner now, to be fair to you? Credit where credit is due now. That was very good. Re is my favorite. <laughs> I hate hen. I imagine I went back and he's like, no, sorry. <laughs> I don't buy them anymore. <laughs> so, he's so upset. God damn it, he stopped buying sticks. I hate him. You don't even have a job. Don't look at me. <laughs> Just run away. The poor guy is like, you've imprisoned me and you've not assigned me a job. Might be able to feed the cows real quick if I have some wheat. I don't know, will they be up for eating again? But if you're up for breeding, gang, just come over here. Oh, Jesus, they are. Oh, darn. They're more than happy to breed. Good job, gang. Good job, Ner. Keep up the good work now. That's gonna expand way too quick. <laughs> the farm is so small. <laughs> I need more fences. All right. Not bad. Not a bad day of mining and crafting. <laughs> All right. Let's call it there, I guess. Tame a parrot in the jungle. I was looking at them all right. I was thinking that, geez, they look like a Kevin Parrot, you know? Come here, you feckers. Come on. Come on. Love me. Please. Yes. I thought there was blood on my head there for a second. It looked like fucking blunt trauma to the head. Name the parrot blunt trauma. Okay. I, I like that name. Yeah, I support it. Blunt. Catch me. <laughs> oh, stupid bird. Blunt is high as fuck. <laughs> He's looking at it just like, whoa. You know why his name is Blunt Trauma? Because he's screaming. I mean, he's seen some shit. He watched his brother die in front of his own eyes. He has PTSD. Parrot soup, maybe? Thank you very much for watching some highlights from my streams. They're all recorded over at twitch.tv slash callmekevin. You can find the link in the description. And my main channel is over there, too. Thanks again for watching, and I hope to see you next time.